am in love with the Coco because it is actually making me a lot of money. I'm not going to lie, guys. These guys are just overperforming right now, okay? They went to the Dubai Summit Binance event. They went to the WOW Summit event in Bangkok this week. And they also went to the DevCon 7 event in Bangkok this week with booths and pods in all of those events, right? So what does this mean? This means this is a coin that is a meme coin, but it's not like the other meme coins because they're actually going out there, they're mingling, they're making partners, okay? Uh, and they are promoting their coin through that, okay? Through absorbing their partners' communities, right? So not your standard uh, kind of KOL driven uh, or potentially uh, just weird marketing paths that a lot of these other meme coins take, right? These guys are actually out here just talking to the big dogs, okay? They're getting boosts, they're buying boosts, they raised 24 million, okay? Uh, and now they are on the market, they are doing incredibly well, right? Let me just show you guys their chart here. Uh, it's ridiculous right now, okay? Obviously they had a massive airdrop and that airdrop caused a dump. And then once this airdrop started to recover, or this price started to recover, right? What we did is we got in and we started covering this. And the reason for this is it just ticked every criteria box, right? We talked earlier this year about buying meme coins, the criteria you need to hit, okay? We bought this thing around like 30 million, something like this, right? Or was it 40 million? Can't remember now. But uh, right now, currently, it is chilling. Uh, let me just double check where it is, where it's chilling. Yeah, it's 55 million right now in market cap, okay? And we're up 30% from our entry. So that is something that's massive. Uh, and yeah, I mean, we are literally just about to go into price discovery with this coin, right? So uh, in the last video, we talked about potentially worrying areas for this coin where we might potentially get out. And we said we would potentially get out uh, of this coin if it did get below the 60 minute volume weighted ATR band, right? So it did test that and we said, hey, after that test, right, it's really dependent on the future of this coin, right? And the events that these guys attended in the past week have really helped this coin stay above those levels and helped it continue to rise with just unlimited pressure towards the upside here, right? So we are seeing this thing really challenged from that breakdown point, okay? If we can get over this level here, guys, it's it's go time, okay? It's go time. Obviously, I'm already in, <laughs> okay? But if, you are, if you're considering this coin, you've been following this coin with me, then uh, yeah, this is really the time you want to be looking at it, okay? 17. When we get over that four-hour volume weighted ATR band, that's really the go time. That's really where it, where it can catch up the other coins, where it can really just blast off from there. And again, still a pretty cheap market cap here at 50 million uh, or 55 million. I'm going to bring this up actually on coin market cap. We can see this right here. Okay, so coin market cap right here. We can see uh, currently at 1612. All right, and uh, yeah, market cap is at 55 million up here. So really good stuff from these guys. Okay, they are also very prominent on their socials. I've actually got rid of this because I just uploaded. <laughs> so let me just find this again. Uh, one second, guys. There we go. Beautiful stuff. Okay, so we're going to get their X up here. I'm already following, as you can see. Uh, and um, yeah, so a few things about this coin, okay? They are backed by Binance Chain, okay? Binance Chain gave them 50K in liquidity. They have used that, and that's helped their coin. Uh, some recent news, which is massive, okay, is the BitKet the BitGet wallet in China. Okay, so the Chinese BitGet wallet, okay, you know BitGot, BitGet, very, very uh, popular exchange where they have a wallet, a wallet in China here. Can't talk at the moment for some reason. <laughs> they have a wallet in China, okay, that the Chinese like to use. And uh, yeah, this is somewhat of a launch pad as well. Uh, and yes, they are also backing this coin, as you can see here, right? So this is a post from the BitGet wallet in China. Okay, very prominent in China, these guys. Okay, and uh, yes, they did do a spaces with these guys a couple of days ago. I did listen to this was fantastic okay and uh yeah i mean as you can see they are they're posting about these guys as well right so they're supporting coco coin here and uh yeah they've been doing some giveaways and stuff with these guys so good stuff there all right um they, they they're everywhere right now this coin okay they're everywhere the art is fantastic as well the uh the engagement if we are just going to look at the engagement here 12k impressions 100 likes okay 22 retweets and 28 comments on that bad boy right uh 
This coin isn't just a meme coin though, right? And it's important to say that because a lot of people don't understand this. So let me just explain really quickly. These guys are actually looking to get into the incubation side of crypto. What that means is an incubation, an incubator, I should say, is somewhat of a VC fund, right? So Silicon Valley is an incubator, right? Essentially, or, or it's a bit bigger than an incubator now, but it started off as an incubator, right? And so what an incubator does, it invests in smaller projects with potential, okay? And then it gets a share of those projects, right? Or it gets a token share holding of those projects, right? Uh, so what these guys plan to do is actually invest in a bunch of projects because obviously they raised 24 million, all right? And then the projects that come out of that in the successful areas, all right? Well, these guys are actually going to make money from that. And they're going to put that money back into the coin, okay? So uh, they're not just a meme coin. They're not just like a Pepe or a Doge or whatever, right? Uh, these guys actually have a utility behind them uh, and they are aiming for coins that will be essentially uh, going through uh, and, and aiming for freedom and, uh, and other stuff like this, right? So freedom and uh, liberty, this kind of stuff. And it's a big, big trend at the moment with the election. So uh, any coins in that category, then uh, yeah, it's gonna be massive for those guys to actually uh, to earn from that, right? Uh, because it's a massive trend, it's gonna be a mainstream trend. Any projects that are targeting that trend, uh, they will be making money. That money goes to Coco Coin, Coco Coin, buy their coin back, and then boom, we go up to the moon, okay? So I'm actually gonna change my target here because I actually bought this coin before they came out with this incubation news okay I'm gonna change my target here my target was 4x from my entry point I'm currently up 30% my new target here for this coin is roughly 10x I'm looking at 10x here uh, and that's not actually that far away from my entry right 10x would be about 400 million market cap okay it's currently at 50 million market cap I got in around 40 okay so uh, yeah I mean when you're comparing other meme coins with no utility they're at the billions of market cap right now this coin has so much potential potential, all right, and they are attending events, they're getting out there, they're making new partnerships every single week, okay, uh, and uh, yeah, it's just something that I really do think you need on your radar, okay, I was going to get in and out of this coin, but uh, as we can see here, this coin has absolutely just blown us away uh, in terms of our expectations, so uh, yeah, that's pretty much it on that front. If we are going to look at the chart again and just target this thing and just see what's going on here, okay, so as we said we we are looking for this four hour break if we can break above this point we're breaking above the breakdown point of the airdrop we're breaking above the initial pump point okay and then we enter a price discovery area okay uh, what we can do with this uh, is actually bring up moving averages and talk about areas that we'll be looking for with this, right? So obviously we do have uh, these important key levels brought in by the WAD machine here. Uh, and this is really the dual end all uh, for this coin, right? If we get over 1876, that is for me price discovery. If you are looking to enter this coin, what I'm looking to do uh, to add more to my position potentially here is uh, actually uh, do something like this, right? So if we come up, we break this four hour, we retest the four hour okay around 1734 and then we break the high and enter price discovery that's really the zone in which you want to be looking at potentially entering this thing okay if not just enter it now it looks pretty good <laughs> okay uh, but besides that uh, yes uh, we can actually get rid of this line now this was our structural line before but uh, we're actually going to uh, bring this up to a daily and then make a new structural line here okay so really this thing has been fighting to uh, to get to the top here and this is the current structural line uh, I do see us potentially pulling back here if Bitcoin wants to pull back. So we could actually lose this line uh, for a temporary period, but we have a nice horizontal here to potentially hold us up as well as moving averages on the daily, right? So uh, 14, 15, this kind of area, I am expecting a test of that soon. We have a lot of green candles, but overall, uh, yeah, looking pretty good. And this is kind of the entry points that I'm looking to, to really target here coming through on the daily, okay? Uh, but that is pretty much gonna be it for this video, guys. Have a fantastic day out here. Okay, I will be uploading more about this coin in the future. Uh, and uh, yeah, be sure to check out my shorts and all of that other stuff as well. Okay, I don't just do Coco Coin, guys. If you are coming from Coco Coin, I do a lot of other coins as well. So uh, yeah, but if you're enjoying this, if you want to see more Coco Coin, drop a like on it. Okay, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of this. And I will see you in the next video. Have a fantastic day. Cheers.